In this video, let us see how to get these free VPS with just one line of code using the Google Colab. The cool feature about this VPS is that you have the total of 12 GP and we have used 840 MB and free 5.3 GP. And another cool feature about this VPS is that you have the 6 core CPU and 64 bit architecture. And you can also run Volama on this free VPS. Normally, if you want to run Volama on any device, it will require at least 8 GP of RAM. But here you can see we are installing the Volama and you can run any models available out there. So, let us see how to get this free VPS using the Google Colab. Let's get started. For this, just open any browser and type Google Colab. Click on the first resource that says Welcome to Colab. It will open up a page similar to this. Here you will click on New Notebook. We are gonna create a new notebook now. So now the notebook has been created successfully. Here click on connect here so that we can connect it to the remote server. Now it is connected. Here we will need to copy and paste one code. For that open new tab and type interneq.live. I will provide the link of this in the description. You can just go there and copy the link. So slash page slash google free vps. So you can just go to the description and copy and paste it in the browser. Then you go to the website, the page will look similar to this. Here we have the link. Here just copy this command here. Let me copy this and paste it in the Google Colab. And click on this run button now. Here it will create a session here. Using the session we can connect it to the free VPS. Just like wait for a few minutes. Here you can see we get a new link. Just right click and open this in new tab. Now uh, we successfully got the free VPS without using any credit card or debit card. Click on this plus icon to get our terminal. Now we got our terminal. If you want to update the packages, just type apt update. Now here you can see all the packages are updating. After we update, let's try to upgrade our packages. apt upgrade. Here you can see now all the packages has been upgrading. Now the packages has been upgraded. Let me clear the screen. So if you want to see this free space, just type free hyphen s. Here you can see we have total of 12 GP and currently we have used 1 GP and we have remaining 5.3 GP. If you want to see the number of CPUs, LS CPU. Here you can see the CPU architecture is the 64 bit architecture. It supports both this 32 bit and the 64 bit. And the number of CPU is the, we have the 6 core CPU, here you can see that. So the CPU family is 6. And the model is the Intel Xeon. So let me clear the screen. So if you want to see what are the folders are available in the FIFNS. So these are the folders available and the size accordingly. So let's clear the screen. So if you want to see the worst release of this, you will have to install the NeoFurge. For that, just type the command curl neofurge.sh. So we're gonna open this NeoFurge in the bash. Here you can see it's downloading the NeoFurs. Currently we are using the Ubuntu 22.4 20, version and since it is running 6 minutes. So these are the other information about this VPS. So let's clear the screen. So uh, let's actually install the Volama on this VPS to study the stability of this VPS. Just type Volama download. Click on the first results that says download Volama. Copy this Linux command. So using this we can download the Volama. Right click and paste it and press enter. Here you can see it's downloading the Volama. So normally if you want to run any Volama models you will require at least a GP of run. So let's see. Now the Volama has been installed successfully. So if you take Volama you will get message like this. If you get any message similar to this that means the Volama has been installed successfully. So just click on github to see the list of models available. So if you scroll on it, here you can see these are the models that are available. So you can just copy and paste it in the free VPS to run the Volama. Here if you want to download this, just copy and paste it there. But I will skip this and go to the next step. So if you want to install any package, you can use the apt install command now. So you can see now the python has been installed successfully. If you type python, we will get the python interpreter. Let me uh, exit the python screen. So if you click on the settings, we have all the options. You can change your name and you can also change the color palette. You can change the scroll back also. So let's close this. Let me change the color palette to Ubuntu. So let me close this 
So if we click on the Wi-Fi icon, we have this uh, signal of this UPS and we have this chat cases also. If you want to close this, just click on this uh, int icon here. Just click on that. Now the free VPS has been disconnected. Let's also delete this cell now. Now the free VPS has been terminated successfully. If you want to again run this, just go to the page again in the naked.live that slash page slash Google free VPS. So just copy this command. If you want to run it again, copy this command and go to the Google Collab and create a new code and paste it here and click on this run button. Here you can see now we got our free VPS again. If you click on right, if you just right click and open it in new tab, here you can see we get our free VPS again. So this is how you get your free VPS without any debit card or the credit card. We're just using the Google Collab using one line of code. This is for this video and the will continue in the next one.